Hey guys, did you know that many crypto projects were using artificial intelligence long before the hype? Like, yep, lots of use cases out there. And in today's video, I invite you to explore them and some stellar AI powered projects. Because you know, the hype brings profits. So stay with me until the very end and you'll learn how AI changes crypto trading. Walking Fire Projects leverages this technology for a long time. Why you should follow AI crypto projects and how much you can potentially earn. So without further ado, let's roll. Okay, so AI is the biggest trend in recent months and it seems like it will last at least until 2024. After all, technology is developing exponentially. You may have already noticed how AI-related crypto projects have shown explosive growth. For example, Fetch.io, SingularityNet, and Ocean Protocol, whose tokens have grown like four or 10 times. Given the crypto winter, the figures are just staggering. So if you want to learn what makes these projects so juicy, watch our recent video here. However, there are many other projects in different niches that actively use AI and therefore have hidden potential for growth. So let's consider specific AI use cases in crypto in projects related to them. So starting off with the good old classic, AI for trading. So what I've managed to find in the web are four main use cases. Trading bots that analyze market data and execute trades automatically based on predetermined strategies. They can quickly process large amounts of data and make trades at optimal times, improving trading efficiency and profitability. Next, sentiment analysis that uses AI algorithms to analyze social media, news articles, and other sources of data to determine market sentiment. Next, predictive analytics. Here, AI is used to analyze data and make predictions about future market trends. In DeFi, predictive analytics can be used to forecast asset prices, identify market opportunities, and manage risk. And last but not least, portfolio optimization. So it is where AI can analyze market data and recommend portfolio allocations based on risk tolerance and investment objectives. Okay, so let me share my opinion on AI for trading cryptocurrencies. Firstly, I see the point in complex solutions that include at least three or four use cases described above. Well, otherwise the use of AI seems more like a marketing ploy to me. But this situation with trading bots is a little bit different. They can be useful for newbies or traders using different strategies. However, trading bots often use simple algorithms that do not even require AI intervention. Nonetheless, if you are interested in promising projects in this direction, I recommend paying attention to Gumbot, Pionex, and Dash to Trade. And by the way, AI has developed so much that text-to-text -text AI chat GPT can already write you a trading bot of any complexity. Well, just ask him. Well, we live in an amazing time, surely. Okay, next, sentiment analysis and price prediction are two use cases that potentially can be improved by AI integrations. But I know that many solutions were doing their job pretty well, even without AI. Okay, AI optimized portfolio sounds like a good idea. Well, due to its machine learning algorithms, it can recognize dangers or promising patterns and react beforehand, which can potentially save you money. And by the way, Forbes had an interesting article on that topic, so the link will be in the description below. Okay, so we're done with this section, and let's move on to our final boss, and the biggest one, GameFi. Okay, in my humble opinion, gaming is much more suitable for AI than any other segment in crypto. Well, at least for now. So I found five interesting use cases for AI in GameFi. First, it is AI-powered game design. One way AI is used in GameFi is by generating game content and design elements. AI algorithms can analyze large data sets of game elements, such as characters, levels, game mechanics, and generate new content based on patterns 
Ian Trans. Well, I heard that Cetus Heroes are planning to use AI to create landscapes for planets, which is sounds really cool to me. Next, player behavior analysis. So AI can be used to analyze player behavior and preferences, such as playing style in game choices. This data can then be used to optimize the game design and personalize the gaming experience for each player. So I know that Gala Games are using this type of AI in their project, but unfortunately, I cannot say if it really brings some benefits here. Number three, fraud detection and prevention. Because you know, GameFi projects often involve in-game economies and digital currencies, which can be vulnerable to fraud and hacking. So AI here can be used to detect and prevent fraudulent activity, such as botting and cheating, to ensure a fair and secure gaming experiences for all the players. Well, first, this idea sounds nice, but if fraudsters will find a way to even cheat AI, well, this path may stay unnoticed for a long, long time. Well, as a good example here, I'd pick Sorare. Frankly, this AI will be more in demand for gambling and betting projects. Virtual assistants and chatbots can help improve the player experience and provide a more engaging and immersive gaming environment. For example, chatbots can answer player questions and guide game mechanics and strategies. I know that Decentraland uses AI-powered chatbots to assist players and provide personalized recommendations. Well, the chatbot is named DCLBot and can answer player questions, provide guidance on game mechanics and also strategies, and also recommend virtual real estate properties based on player preferences. And yeah, it is generally okay, but sometimes you need a human to solve your bots. Honestly, these base phrases drive me mad. Next, dynamic game balancing based on player performance and behavior. So this can help ensure that game remains challenging and engaging for all the players, regardless of their skill. Here, AI algorithms can analyze player data and adjust game mechanics accordingly. For example, increasing or decreasing enemy difficulty based on player performance. Nonetheless, it is a quite controversial decision, especially for the PvP format. You see, many companies like EA Sports already use the so-called handicap system in FIFA, for example. So the AI tweaks the gameplay to its liking and it's not the best experience to have. Well, perhaps this is the use case I don't support at all. Okay, I like to put an additional emphasis on major game five projects, which in my opinion, had the biggest progress of using AI tech. And as a result, they can generate more attention due to the AI hype. So let's see those. First, it is Axie Infinity that uses AI to generate unique game characters and also analyze player behavior and optimize gameplay mechanics. So Axie Infinity also uses AI-powered matchmaking algorithm to make gameplay more fair and balanced. Next, Star Atlas that uses AI to generate game content like planets and spaceships and also to personalize the gaming experience for each player. AI algorithms will analyze player data to determine player preferences and behavior, and then adjust game mechanics accordingly. Next, Decentraland, and besides its chatbot we have discussed already, it uses AI algorithms to generate virtual real estate properties, which are treated as digital assets. Okay, next, when it comes to Cities, I know that AI is enhancing its metaverse in many, many different ways. And besides, they always plan new integrations. So to me, it seems like the Cetus team is using AI to automatically generate realistic lip synchronization and facial expressions from the audio input. Besides, they also stick to Cascader, a tool that enables the creation of ultra-realistic animations with residual movement. And by the way, Cetus CEO Dan Komenko mentioned the creation of human-like bots with the final aim to create the most intelligent and nuanced bot behavior possible. The company is testing out different AI tools for storage, which can significantly reduce its cost. As the final points for Cetus Heroes, they are using conventional generative algorithms 
in creation of generative open world locations. So I think once the open worlds will be launched, we'll get the chance to see it on our own. So AI is something incredible, but relatively new to crypto as lots of projects are widely using AI technologies nowadays. So it seems like with such hype, any of aforementioned projects can bring you easy profit even during this cold crypto winter. And if the AI topic is of interest to you, you must check out this video comparison of the hottest AI text generators that we rolled out previously. And if you think that ChatGPT is the only option, well, you are terribly wrong. As always, guys, thanks for watching, slap that like, subscribe to the channel, and see you soon.